Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Jackson. Jackson, hey buddy. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I am getting my coffee ready this morning. Yum. And my brother and sister-in-law left already, and they have a lot to do today, and then they're coming back tomorrow, which would be exciting. But today, I don't think we have anything planned. I do have some chores to do around the house, and um, I'm pretty sure we all have a slight cold. So we're just gonna take it easy and try to rest our bodies a little bit and relax before we have a really fun weekend. So Jackson is waking up from his morning nap. And to be honest, none of us have really felt good this morning. Chris slept in a little bit. Well, it all started like a few days ago when Jane had a runny nose, like right after we got back from the mountain house. And I thought maybe it was just um, different allergies there maybe um, is why she had a runny nose. But then Chris started to feel like he was getting like a runny nose and like scratchy throat and just like a little bit achy yesterday. And now I'm feeling like that today. And Jane still has a runny nose. Jackson's nose is running a little bit. And this morning, Jane has felt a little bit warm to me. Chris just went to work, so hopefully he's feeling a little bit better. I think he's not feeling 100%, but it's probably just like a small cold. It's not anything major. And so the thermometer is in Jackson's room, but he is waking up now. So I'm going to go ahead and take all of our temperatures to make sure we don't have fevers. Come on, Jane. Come on. We got to wake up Jackson. Well, he's already awake, but we gotta go get him. Is he getting fussy? Did you ask him if he was getting fussy? Okay, no, let's see if he's gonna. My little Hi, buddy. Did you have a good nap? Did you have a good nap? Hey. Hey, buddy. Leave his lovey there, Jane. Hey, buddy. Come here. Jane, stop. Stop spinning. Okay, come here. Jane. All right, I'll have to do mine. 98.1. All right, let's do Jane. Jane, come here. Can you sit down so I can take your temperature like Doc McStuffins? Ninety-eight point six. You want me to do the other side? Yeah. I think you're in the clear. I don't think you have a fever. Ninety-eight. Twenty-eight. Are you feeling okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You may hold it. You just got a no a runny nose. Let's take Jackson's temperature. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. No. Hey, buddy. My. Lovely. All right, let's take his temperature. Hopefully he'll stay still. I don't think you're going to have a fever if none of us have fevers, but we'll try. We'll just check. We're just going to check. Hey. Hey. 97.3. 97.3. 
Today is also clean sheet Thursday in our house, which means everyone gets clean sheets. So I've already done Jane's. Let's see. Most of the time they come like a little ball and they're not dry. Let's see, yeah, look at this. How does this happen? Okay. Oh my word. All right, so the good thing about this is that if we are sick, well, we are sick. I just think it's a small cold and then we don't have fever, so that's good. Um, but it's always nice to have clean sheets so that you're not sleeping in a bunch of germs. Okay, we're gonna make Jane's bed. Okay, so her duvet cover is still being dried and we are gonna go down and feed Jackson. I think today is just gonna be a pajama kind of day. We are supposed to go over to our neighbor's house for a cookout, which we are really excited about. You took Jackson's temperature? Yeah. Let me see. Is it good? 26? Yeah. Um, we were supposed to go over to our neighbor's house for a cookout later today, but I think we're probably gonna have to skip. One, because I don't wanna get everyone else sick, and two, we probably just need to rec rest and relax because we are gonna have a really fun weekend, and I don't wanna be like sick and tired the whole weekend. So, today we're probably just gonna stay in our pajamas, so hopefully you guys don't mind. Okay, the hair pulling is like a real thing these days, you guys. He continues to pull on my hair, and now I know why mothers have short hair. Woo! All right. So I'm sitting here and feeding Jackson, and he's being so cute. Hey, hey, guys. Jackson is 12 weeks old today, which means technically it's almost three months. He's gonna be three months on the 30th. So I feel like the time is flying by so fast already. I feel like with Jane, I was trying to rush the early stages just cause I wanted to be able to play with her and do some fun things. And the time kind of went by slow with her. Although looking back, it's gone super fast. Like I cannot believe she's two and a half. But with Jackson, just because I guess I have a two and a half year old and we're just like going, going, going all the time, the time has already flown by. I feel like he should only be like four weeks old or something. So cute. Got both my babies sitting in my lap. Right, Jane? What? I'm watching a little bit of cartoons before we eat lunch. Even though Jackson just ate. Right, buddy? Oh, I can sit like this all day. Me too. Okay, now. Hey. 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 I eat your mama. Okay. You want to see my eyes? You talking? Hey, go, mom. Thank you. Okay, so it is time for dinner. Like I said, we were supposed to go over to our neighbor's house for a cookout, but since we're not feeling that great, we're just gonna stay home. So I think we have some steaks here. Yep. Oops. Did I just break my refrigerator? Um, and so we're gonna cook those, but I also have a potato. And I'm gonna try something else. I was gonna do a baked potato, but I think I'm gonna try something different and do like chips kind of so we'll see how this works okay so i just thinly cut um the potato into little strips and i tried to do um the same size or the same thickness so that they cook evenly and then i'm gonna just pour a little bit of this it's from target the archer farms roasted garlic and herb oil we love their oil we use obviously um extra virgin olive oil a lot while cooking but these are always fun. They have like, they have a few different flavors. Like I said, this one's the garlic and herb one. 
and it's just extra virgin olive oil with a little bit of twist and um, we also tried the spicy ones before Oops. the one with like the red pepper in it sorry I'm not looking at the camera I'm trying to get this so those are always good now I'm just gonna try to even this out a little bit better okay I'm just gonna use this little brush that way the oil gets on each piece I didn't really want Mom, this much cakes. oil, but pancakes. Mom, pancakes. these aren't pancakes. These are potatoes. Oh. It's going to be kind of like french fries. I'm going to make it french fries. Yeah, does it look good? Yeah. All right. And then I have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm just going to put this in a 425 degree oven and see what happens. So it is currently six o'clock and usually Chris is home by now. I think he stayed at work a little bit later than normal, but it is going to be a huge storm outside. And I can't really say it loud because Jane has been freaked out lately of storms. Even when there's blue skies outside, when it's time for her to take a nap or go to bed, she asks if there's a storm and it's been thundering a little bit here and she's already freaking out. So try not to say the word out loud. But here it is outside right now. It's kind of just rainy, a little bit windy. But Chris just said that it is pouring rain. They're going five miles an hour on the highway and he can't see anything. So I'm pretty sure he is going to be a little bit late. And so I'm trying to figure out dinner. I cook sometimes. I'm good at cooking like sides and that's about it and dessert. But Chris usually does the meats and I can usually put like chicken in the oven and I know when it's done and stuff like that But steaks especially I have no idea what I'm doing So I had to call him to ask him how to cook it because I can't really wait for him to get here and then cook it because then it'll be too late So I'm actually gonna try to cook this steak my potatoes are also in the oven that I showed you guys I have no idea how those are gonna turn out either. So this dinner might be a huge fail. Oh They're like frying in there with the oil I don't know how that's gonna work out and then I need to find some sort of veggie as well so wish me luck guys first of all I just came out here to water my plants and I just want to say there is nothing like the smell of a hot summer thunderstorm it smells so good here yeah Jane's making fun of me because my blue flowers died. Look, there they are, just little sticks now. What happened? Little sticks. They died? Yeah, I died. They I died. died Mom. You didn't die, the flowers did. Oh, and I died. I, the flowers did. Yeah. It smells so good out here. Anyways. I also wanted to show you one thing. I'm horrible at keeping plants alive, like awful. I cannot keep anything alive. But my grandmother bought me this flower bush thing um, for when Jackson was born. And I've kept it alive so far, but it's slowly dying. This was full, like it would, you couldn't see it anywhere. It was like super full and super pretty. But now it's just slowly dying. I don't know if it's like too hot out here or what's going on. But this plant my mom got me, well, she got me two plants. She got me this plant right here that looks like it's dying um, for when Jackson was born as well. And the hydrangeas that died already. So they've lasted, Jackson's almost three months old. So I'm pretty proud of myself. But this plant right here, as you can see, it looks pretty bad. It looks like it's really thirsty and hot. I try to water it every other day, and yes, I have to write it down to remind myself or I totally forget, but sometimes it ends up looking like that even after just one day of not being watered. Take a good look, and I'm gonna come back out here after dinner, and I swear to you, this plant will look like a totally different plant. It'll just look like it's revived and happy again, so just be ready. Okay, so my potatoes are done. I'm not sure how they taste, but they look good. Let me show you. Jane, get off the table. Okay, Mom. Here they are. Some of them are a little crispier than others. They're definitely not crispy, which I didn't really care if they were or not. 
but they are a little bit too oily. So I'm just gonna transfer them Mommy, onto a napkin Mommy, to kind of get some of the oil Mommy. off. So we'll have to see how they taste once Chris gets home. Okay, dinner is ready and we're gonna see how it tastes. So, no, I told them that I never cook potatoes like this and I don't really cook steak. So we'll have to see how it tastes. Jane's having some There's too. There's leftover pizza in the fridge, so if it's all. <laughs> well, leftover good. pizza from last night, so yeah. Well, we're good to go in case. I like it. Yeah. That's good, Mom. You like potatoes? Mm -hmm. So I said they weren't gonna be like crunchy. They're not crunchy, right? I'm glad it's good. You need ranch dressing. Ranch dressing? Mmm. So yeah. I like it. They're pretty good and it was easy to make. You can work up. The green beans are out of a can, so you can't go wrong with those. Mommy, I can't like the potatoes. You don't like the potatoes? I'll eat them. I like them. I'll have them, okay? No, that's mine. So we like our steak medium rare. I think I did a pretty good Mommy, job. I'll go eat it, Mom. Looks I'm good. I'll go eat it, Mom. I'm an mm. Uncle Edgemon. Can I sit down? My Uncle Edgemon. They're coming back tomorrow. Sit down in your chair. Well, I can't sit down. I don't know. I don't have to watch it. Hey, Mom. That's good. Mm, that's good. I think it was a success. Okay, so it is currently the next day, but I was editing the video and I noticed that oh, there is a hair. And I noticed that the clip that I showed you the plant was way too dark, you couldn't even see the plant. So here it is the next day, looking like new. I told you guys, it looks all dead and then the next day or a few hours later after you water it, it's brand new. Can't kill this plant. So I need more plants like this. We tired. Okay. Yeah, I don't like we sleeping in rest. There we resting. They resting. Okay, can you show me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, they're sleeping, Mom. Let it be quiet. Okay. I have to go sit down with Daddy. Yeah. Okay. Good night, Lala. Good night, lovey. Good morning. Good morning, Ma. Good morning. Are we rest? We rest in in the bathroom. You rested in the bathroom. No, that's a bed in here. Look, I'm pouring the bed. Yeah. Oh my poo poo is gonna play. My toy is gonna play. Yeah. Yeah. I wanna go play now. The mm. apple game. I'm gonna play the apple game. Yeah. All right. Let's tell let's tell everyone bye on the camera. Thanks guys for watching the video today. We're gonna go ahead and end it. It is still kind of early, but we still gotta get the kids bathed and in bed, and then Chris and I are probably just gonna relax since we're not feeling the greatest. Um, hopefully we'll be better by tomorrow. And thanks for hanging in there with bye. us as we're still in our pajamas bye. from earlier. Bye, bye. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel. We will see you guys tomorrow. What do you say? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Can you say subscribe? Subscribe. 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 <laughs> bye.